and welcome back to another episode of Piping Up. Today we are here in the Poconos. We are visiting um, Mount Pocono United Methodist Church here uh, right in the Poconos. It's about an hour and a half away from where we typically shoot videos, uh, which is usually in Great Town or Sellersville. We're branching out and we're starting to check out new organs. The organ here today is a uh, Walker technical organ. It's really a great organ. It's a smaller one than what we've typically worked with but this one is amazing. It is a Rogers uh, console, and this one is a little bit smaller than the ones we typically work with, but today we're gonna check it out. So join me as we check out this amazing pipe organ.
This Wonker technical organ is probably one of the best I've seen um, from a two manual pipe organ. Now, this thing is kind of special in a way uh, because whilst it has a great and uh, swell uh, manual on both, it also has the option uh, for solos, uh, for solo stops, which kind of makes it cool in a sense. So besides just your usual uh, swell uh, stops, which you can choose from a variety of different options, you also have several solo options as well, which includes some of the, uh, the best ones that are available, including uh, the festival trumpet, or possibly the cello. And all of this together creates an amazing experience for the organ. Uh, English horn. And just combining that all together with all your other options on the swell, speaking of like the oboe. And at the same time, mixing it with a bunch of different other stops, including pedal stops, which there are two 32 uh, stops on this organ. Uh, it's kind of a common thing for most organs uh, for two manuals. Um, this almost uh, replicates the Allen Renaissance 270, though in a sense, that one does not include any solo stops, but this one does. So with a Walker technical organ, you can choose, pick and choose what you would like uh, to have at the, to make the experience in your church um, just even more grand. Um, Alan does an excellent job of choosing and picking and creating sounds, but this just does a really great job of creating and voicing the sounds for an authentic organ experience. This is a Walker Technical, and this is the third one that we've looked at in these episodes. This is the smallest of the three so far, but this is also the farthest one that I have seen that has um, in Pennsylvania since Walker Technical is in Center Valley, which is probably about an hour and a half away from here. So seeing a Walker Technical uh, organ in this area is actually quite impressive. So. Enjoy music.
And so now as we conclude this episode, uh, this was an amazing pipe organ to play on, and I'm going to be coming back eventually over the next few weeks. Uh, this will be probably the organ I'll be practicing on since it's probably the best one in the area and the closest one. Hopefully we'll get to check out some more organs in the area, but until then, stay tuned. Uh, this is the first episode in a while, so if you are watching and you've stuck all the way through this video, uh, thanks so much for watching. Um, this is something that I've always wanted to do, and now that I am uh, able to go out and about and just kind of visit different organs, uh, it makes um, it makes a lot of um, time, and it takes a lot of time to do this. But it, you know, some of this time is uh, playing things like this is what I enjoy. Uh, so if you are still watching, thanks so much for watching. My name is Stephen Reggett. This has been an episode of Piping Up. So long. Uh...